A big chunk of Biloxi still needs to boil its water for safety tonight. New results today from water testing found no E. coli bacteria in the Bradford Street well, but that doesn't mean you can run and grab a glass just yet. There's still a few steps left in the process to make sure your water is safe. Later tonight, we'll check in on how safety concerns are impacting your favorite stores and restaurants. But first, Leslie Rojas starts us off with the latest on the city's water supply. Water from the Bradford Street well in Biloxi is being flushed after E. coli was found by the Mississippi State Department of Health. Where it had been found was in a raw sample, which means no chemicals were put in at the water well. Since then, a boil water notice is affecting south parts of the city. Uh, right now, we're, we're boiling all our water. Uh, they're saying that it's good to bathe in, but not to get it in your mouth. Hurley Smith lives on Magnolia Street, right There's next to the well. He's not only dealing with a water boil notice, but his home is flooding from the flushing process. It's supposed to go to the bayou over here next to the church, but uh, technically it's, well, as you can see, I sunk to my ankles right there. So eventually it's going to creep up toward my house if it if it's last any length of time. Time plays a huge role on when this notice will be lifted. So far, the city has not found E. coli in testing they've conducted. Nothing has been found in the lines that causes a boil water notice, except for that E. coli, which was at in a raw sample right at the base of the well. And that has been cleared on the city's part, but it's just waiting to for the Mississippi State Department of Health to lift that boil water notice and clear the entire system. Just because the city hasn't found E. coli in water lines doesn't mean the water is safe to consume. Continue to follow precautions that Mississippi State Department of Health has put in place to continue to boil water. Once the notice is lifted, it will be put out and you'll be able to um, stop boiling your water. Bradford Street Well is now closed the city continues to conduct testing. For now, Biloxi residents will continue dealing with the water crisis. In Biloxi, Leslie Rojas, WLOX News Now.